What is up guys welcome back to another SLRR video uh, today we are going to be taking on the rest of the red cheetah we won the race of champions once I do plan on going back and doing it again but first I want to clear out the rest of these night races let's go ahead and skip to 10 p.m. so we can get to the so here we are out in the city we just have to go ahead and find these races here um, also I've been adjusting the volume a little bit so it might take a little bit of trial and error to get all of the levels good. I also ended up buying a uh, shock mount for my microphone. So that'll help a little bit with like desk noise and things like that and typing on my keyboard. Uh, I'm kind of curious to see how the audio is going to sound with this car because this car is just obnoxiously loud with this V16. But hopefully, oh boy, getting some lag. Hopefully it sounds okay. Um, I also turned the gain down on my microphone so there isn't as much background noise like my controller, the keyboard, and things like that. So let's see, is this the start or is this the end of the race? This is the end, so we want to go to the opposite side here. I also went back and watched some of my old videos and kind of just saw what I thought was good and what didn't work so well. So I do have a pretty good idea on how I want to make my videos now. I'm kind of in a in a weird state where I'm trying to figure out how to edit these things, how to how to record these things, the different volumes, things like that. So it'll take a little bit to get everything totally figured out, but I don't remember what I have the red line set up. This thing, I think it's like eight thousand. This thing hauls though. That guy was the easy race. But I'm hoping that we can get all the uh, Red Flame beat because there is a race that I want to try doing. It's like a 20 lap race and it's it's like a $500,000 winning. So that's a lot of money. So if we beat all these guys, we'll be able to do that. I think it's like $20,000 to enter it and it's a 20 lap race. So it would probably be its own video. Uh, so that'd be pretty neat. And we'd make a bunch of money. I mean, $500,000, that's equivalent to doing a lot of night races. And if it takes 20 laps and, you know, the, ra the race itself takes... So, who are we racing here? A Doohan Sunstrip 2.0. This guy should be a piece of cake. Uh, but if that race takes about 20 minutes or so... I mean, $500,000 in 20 minutes is, is easy. Easy money. So we'll have to check that out. There's also another one where it's just a big oval ring and it's like 20 laps. So that one would be interesting as well. I was just kind of taking a look at some of the races in between recording the last video and this video. Another easy win. Taking the lead, taking names. That guy's taking the wall, I guess. Whatever works for you, guy. Vince... Polanski versus James Morris and we got an 8.7. It's kind of interesting to see that they don't have any time So I'm wondering if they didn't finish the race like maybe uh, They Went to the outside of the cars rather than the inside because I think if you go to the outside of the car So say this was the finish line and we went to this side. It wouldn't actually count as us crossing the finish line I think that's how it works. I'm not 100% sure. So number three and we got the Whisper, and we got a twenty-one and a half thousand dollar race. That's not bad. I'd like to get my money above a uh, million dollars again. That'd be that'd be real nice. So let's line up against this guy. This guy I think has a V12, so this will be an interesting race because the V12 is also really fast in this game too. Uh, if I build another car, I'm definitely gonna be using that engine. Oh geez, for a good reason. Yeah, that guy pulls on me hard. Oh, oh! Wait, did we win? That was a close race. I think we might have pulled on him just a little bit at the end there. My car was like impossible. Oh no. 
Oh, there goes 20,000. All right. And some prestige. I don't I don't know what my prestige was beforehand, but I'm curious to see what it is now. So we got 271. I know we were at f like 300,000 before we started all this. Uh, so let's go ahead and go back to the garage and replace those back tires. They're starting to lose some grip anyways. Let's replace this back bumper or fix it, I should say. Fix that. How are these tires doing? Yeah, we got 50%, 42, 84. Do we have any good tires yet? Yeah, we do have two good tires yet. Who needs a lift? Just change your tires on the ground there. So that should be fine. Where are those two? Let's get rid of these because honestly anything below 50% is not going to be very viable. 63%, these aren't going to be... I want can we, we can't repair tires, can you? Yeah, that's what I figured. So let's get rid of those as well. We got one at 72 and one at 70. Those are pretty good. Yeah, we could use those as front tires. Oh, we got a whole bunch of them. We got... Yeah, we have a lot of tires. Okay, that's that's good at least. So let's go ahead, head back out, and then try and beat that guy again. So I think this time my plan of attack is going to be... Oh, we can race this guy again too. Let's go ahead and race him. Get some, some money and some prestige back. Uh, but I think this time I'm going to do like a second gear launch and then just nitrous the whole way. And hopefully we can keep up with him and then pass him at the end there if we can't keep up with him in the beginning. The V12 in this game is just crazy. I think it puts out like 2,000 horsepower or something like that. And I mean, this guy, we don't have to do anything crazy, so I could have launched a little... Or I didn't need to launch as hard, I guess, just what I'm trying to say. Because that guy's a lot slower than a lot of the other cars. We need to paint our car. It looks like junk. Bumpers scratched like crazy. So let's go ahead and head back here. I don't know why I keep getting these weird, li weird little like hits to my frame rate. Strange. I should I should be running pretty stable. It's weird playing the the disc version versus this. So just the 2.2.1 is so stable compared to this game. So this time we can only race them for 16,000. But hopefully we can we can beat him this time, so I don't lose another sixteen thousand dollars. If we don't win against him, then then we're in trouble. So let's start in second gear. Three, two, one, go. Nope. Nope. Yeah, boy. Sometimes you gotta race dirty. Like I just did. Our car didn't even get that messed up. I'll take it. Our door is open for some reason, but that's okay. So what's our prestige at now? Our prestige is at 266. So it doesn't even matter. It still went down. So I guess it's not a, a huge deal that we lost that race because either way our prestige is going to keep going down because it's so high. Which is still weird. I'd still like to figure out how to prevent that. I don't know if it's just because our prestige was so high in the beginning of the game. So maybe I do plan on doing like another playthrough of this game. Oh, so we got another whisper. I wonder if this guy is going to be like a V8 or something. So let's see what this guy has. So that guy sounds like, it looks like he has a V12, yeah. Oh, this guy stalled out at the, at the start line, so I didn't even need nitrous that entire time. Well, that one was easy, I guess we know if we need to go back and make some money, we can always go back and race him, and we'll be over a million dollars with this race again, so that'll be nice. A million dollars legitimately in a career. It's always neat. So we got one more race and we are the number one racer in Velo City. Pretty neat. It's really funny, I'm at like episode what eighteen now and I'm finally getting to the end of this. So yeah, we got a Coop Sport DTM. This guy I don't think should be much of an issue at all to race against. 
because I, I feel like this guy's gonna be a lot slower than those whispers were. Well, I mean, that one was obviously no issue at all because he stalled out. Yeah, this guy's gonna be a cakewalk. And there you have it, folks. We are the number one racer in Velo City. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Wrap it up and put it under the treesy. Got a Steam achievement, Red Devil, for the number one racer in Velo City. Nice. So I believe if we go back to the race now, there should be nobody else to race. I don't think we'll be able to race the last guy twice. Uh, if we went back to the garage and then came back here, we should be able to race him. But I don't think he'll just show up in the race again. So if we do this, yeah, there's no opponents to race against. Come back later. So let's head back to the garage and I'm just gonna tow back to the garage. No use trying to, to drive all the way back. Let's go ahead and close this door. We don't need our door open anymore. Uh, looks like this bumper may have gotten a little goofed, so let's re repair that. Everything else looks okay. We just need, like, a respray. So I think what I'm going to do is go to running gear. Whoops, and not brakes. And find... Let's see, it's going to be... This one... Let me look at the tires first, because there's the skinnier drag slick, so 12 and a half inch wide. Let's buy these, and then we're going to need these wheels. Because I don't want the super wide slicks for, for road racing, because I feel like it's just going to be way too grippy, and the car is going to flip over and do a bunch of crazy stuff that we don't want it to do. How are these brakes looking as well? 56. Let's go ahead and repair all of these while we're here. So the, the one thing I'm not sure about how I want to edit is like fixing things on the car. I do like, so this one's going to be one of the back brakes. I do like doing it all on video like this, but I also like editing it where it's just clicking the parts on and off the car, you know, repairing them and things like that. So it's going to be, you know, just that that I really need to make a decision on. So let's buy the or throw those on and then put these on as well. These ones are kind of nice. They don't stick out as far. And let's take a look at this race that I want to do. So it's going to be, oh yeah, God, drifting in this game. No bueno. It's going to be a bit way at the end here. So this is the one that I was looking at. It's 20 laps, six participants, and the, the gold cup prize is 35,000. Otherwise, there is this one too, but we need three wins in the race of champions, and we need a manual transmission and no nitrous. And it's $500,000 with an entry fee of 20,000. This race looks like it would be absolutely insane though. So let's take a look at this one. Oh, we need no nitrous. Let's go ahead and take our nitrous out. Let's see, that's going to be just on the passenger side here. So we should be able to just take the bottle out. And now I need to go all the way back to that race. So now we can enter. Let's go ahead and give this race a try. I'm not sure how well our car is going to do compared to these other cars. It looks like it's just a bunch of Einwagen, so we should be okay. Oh, no, we do have some... Uh, Nonus, I think those are. I'm also not sure how we'll edit this race. Oh, it looks like we got an easy lead on these guys. And this one also has, like, penalties for clean racing and things like that. Wow, this thing does not handle very well. Uh, because, you know, if I've got a big lead, it's not going to be very interesting to watch. So I think what I'll do is I'll record a couple laps here, and then... I'm going to record the whole thing and just edit out the really boring parts and then just record, you know, if I end up passing these guys or things like that and then just, just do it that way because otherwise this entire race would be pretty boring to watch. Do some braking here. Oh, it came in a little too hot. It's also a little hard to see. I got my microphone right in the middle of my screen. It's another thing I need to do is figure out a good spot for that thing. This car does handle pretty good, though. Let's see what this lap time is going to be. 
Oh, we got a guy spun out up here. We got a 30, 30 second lap time. Ooh, hit the wall a little bit there. Coming out of the corner a little too high. That guy is in the stands. Jesus. And we're coming up on these guys. We have to be careful not to hit them. And we have to be careful that they don't hit us. Because if they hit us, we'll get a penalty. And that is never good. Shifted up a little too fast there. There we go. Man, this lap is go or this race is going a little easier than I thought it would. Oh, if I if I didn't come in really hot there. See, this is fun. I could do this for a while. I could do this race multiple times and have a good time. Swing past this guy, see ya. And now we're in front of the pack again. We have officially lapped everybody. Oh, uh, this is gonna be interesting though because our two right tires are looking pretty rough. I wonder if we had extra tires in our inventory, if we could pit and then replace those tires. I don't really know how, how that works in this game. So there we got a 32 second lap time. And now we're coming up on lapping this guy a second time. And we are sliding quite a bit. I'm not sure how long these tires are going to last. It looks like they are already dead. Which is interesting because these tires were brand new before this race. And we're coming up on this guy as well. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's get around him. Oh no. Slid a little bit and hit him. That's funny. I think that's the first time I've actually got rude driving that is actually deserved. Yeah, our car's getting a little tough to corner now because of those tires being so bad. It's only a matter of time before they pop and then this thing's going to get very unstable. Coming up on this guy here. Let's see if we can get a clean pass. Ooh, maybe not. Pass him on the inside here. Let's see if we can get around this guy. Ooh, he's being a little, he's being a little tricky. Yeah, we definitely have to slow down a lot more now with our tires being so bad. At least we don't have to worry about losing our lead too much because we are so far ahead. We've got eight more laps. Looks like our rear tires are just about done for. My, my left rear tire is uh, doing pretty rough too. Yeah, it's getting real tough to turn. I really need to slow down a lot for these corners now because these tires are getting so bad. If I go any faster than this, I just start to slide everywhere. So that's going to not help our, tr uh, our lap times at all.
Oh no, we're coming in real hot. Bouncing off the wall a little bit there. And we're coming up on lapping this guy again. Let's get a clean pass. Beautiful. We have uh, five laps left. Oh boy, should be looking at the road, not the laps. Let's get on the inside here. So I'm really needing to slow down a lot for that corner. Otherwise, I just slide through the entire thing. So that's really killing our track times. Even our straight lines are getting a lot slower just because with, uh, without all that grip, don't go anywhere. Okay, so we now have just one lap left. Or actually, two laps, because I think we need to do lap 20 yet. And this is getting real sloppy. I think my rear right tire is probably blown by now. My rear left tire is getting real close. I have to almost get into third gear for the short corner. Just slide the corners. Who needs good grip? Just drift it. Alright, so now this is our last lap. Let's just drift the whole corner. This time is gonna be terrible. Dang, it looks like all of our tires are junk now. Yeah, I don't think I could even try to do this corner normally if I tried. And there we go. 20 lap race in our back pocket. Easy peasy, $35,000. What was it, like $2,500 to do that race? So that's not bad. That's like $30,000, $31,000. That's pretty close to what we were getting in those those night drags. It's actually a little bit more than we were getting in some of them, in a lot of them. So that's good. Our tires are at 0%, 14%, 0%, and 0%. So that definitely killed all of our tires. I would be interested to see how it did with like the 19 inch, uh, what are they, the street tires? Whoops, not that, I need this running gear tires uh so like these ones or these ones i wonder how these would do on something like that that's where i'm going to end this one please leave a like if you like subscribe if you want to see more and i will see you in the next one